question by a few. And that is, how do I engage my learners? What reward systems do I use? And today I thought I would share with all of you what I've learned over the past year. What works with my children? I'll give you a hint. This is a winner, especially with kids who love dinosaurs. Your heart desires will come. So I hope everyone is doing well. If you haven't signed up yet to be a teacher online, please drop me a, an email. I'm leaving below my email and reach out to me and I'll help you narrow down what the best company will be to fit your teaching style. So, as you know, I teach for a few different companies, which I love. When I'm figuring out the different rewards that I'm going to use for the child, I try to get to know the child and then I adjust accordingly. For most of them, I start with a very basic reward. I have shown my bubble gum before, where I have the machine with the added bubble gums. The other one I wanted to show you that I have now been using for the girls is my castle. And yes, if boys want this, they sure can. I don't care. But this is a winner with the girls, especially the first time. If they're older children, I will evolve into some other ideas. But all the girls so far have loved the princesses in the castle. Sometimes I'll name them after the child, their mother, there I am. The kids love it. Another one that I picked up from Etsy is a My Little Pony. Now girls and boys have loved this and it's always fun when the children know the different names, but this has been a winner for a reward system lately. This is my new one. My third one that children have absolutely loved, and it's kind of fun, so I'll show you. This is my monster, and my monster has, lose, has lost his teeth. Excuse me, Luz, lost his teeth. So what will happen is I'll say, help me, I can't eat. They love it. So then, when they're in the middle of talking, I will turn my head or move to the side and come back, and they laugh. I go, oh! Thank you. <gasps> How many teeth does our monster have? They love that. For the smaller children, I keep it simple. I just have a really cute rabbit. And this is just one I made from the internet. Oh, <gasps> carrot, carrot. The littles love this rabbit. With one of my companies, I can actually turn into a rabbit. So that makes it even better. The last one that is actually physical I wanna show you is my Under the Sea, which I love. I'm very goofy in the fact that I will sing to them, Under the Sea, Under the Sea. And then we talk about what we have. Those have been awesome. Now, 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 I wanna show you what I learned. So, there are children I've had for a while. They're looking for something new and different. There is a new app called Stars to Apples. I'm gonna to try to show you. Stars to Apples. And I want you to look. It is a $9 fee for the app. I can't give you enough wow about this. It is worth the $9. There are so many different rewards. There are farm matching where, you know, they're either finding an animal or stars. Oh, there's a cow <gasps> for your littles. Chicken, buck, buck, buck. chicken, good job. So they are doing a memory match. 
I wanna show you another one. There is, like we said, a gumball. What color do you like? And they tell you, oh, orange gumball. Yes, good job. There are so many in here that I have used. I haven't even used them all, which is even better. Instead of making my ice creams, I can now just create an ice cream. So, well, it's not working right now, but look, there's that. And of course, I can't drag it right now. But I can essentially make an ice cream for the children. Now I will show you. One hand is too hard. They can pick the colors. This has been game changer. I was spending a lot of money and I still love these, but now everything is kind of in the same place. Okay, one more thing. I'm gonna try to not make this too long. The new thing, they are called, I wanna show you both of them, surprise eggs. There's a girl one or a boy one. Again, you can swap it so that they go for either gender at any time. So what happens? This is fantastic. You're going to see all of these eggs. When a child does a good job, you say, oh, what is it? Ready? You're gonna hold it up close and tap. The egg will slowly open. it mermaid mermaid good job and then you will just go through to the next egg the girls and the boys love this so I would say this keep it fresh rotate it out know your children make it exciting it could be as simple as having your dinosaur head, put this on so I can show you. And I could feed him, and I could feed him an apple. Oh, good job, good job. It's up to you. Just know there are so many ideas. I will drop the app names below so you can see these three different apps I showed you. Remember there's the egg surprise, it's a boy, and a girl one. There's also um, stars to apples. Again, worth the money. You're going to spend it in ink. You're going to spend it on Etsy. You're going to spend it on the internet. Why not have everything at once? Okay, any questions, write to me. I'm here. It was nice to see you. Bye-bye.